Hello friends, welcome to Sunday. And I said friends because it's one of the things I talked about yesterday. For the record, I haven't even edited yesterday's video, so I certainly haven't seen your responses. So I'm interested in seeing them, but... You're uh, interested in seeing them? Interested. God, I just woke up. We have to wake up, though, because it is time. It is time for crock pot pork loin roast. William uh, sent this recipe in to us, um, God, like two, maybe three weeks ago. And we were interested, it's just we had a lot of other stuff to make. But now, now we're making it. Four to six pounds of pork loin, one clove of garlic minced, salt and pepper, one cup brown sugar, one tablespoon of Dijon mustard, one tablespoon of balsamic vinegar. You wash the pork roast, trim the fat, pat dry, rub with garlic, sprinkle with salt and pepper, with a fork, prick the pork all over, and then in a small bowl combine brown sugar, Dijon mustard, and uh, balsamic vinegar. Rub all over the pork loin, cover, and cook on low for seven to nine hours. Pretty simple. And I'm about to uh, mix up these ingredients. Besides dinner, and we always do this on Sunday, I think uh, almost every Sunday we do some kind of meal in the crock pot that, that takes forever. But besides that, um, my agenda today <laughs> is going to be finishing this game. For those who are unaware, I put in, God, I don't know, like 70 hours into Fallout 3 like a year or two ago, and I never finished the game, but I got right to the end. So today, I'm finally going to beat Fallout 3. Oh, and uh, yesterday we bought a brighter light bulb. You guys probably can't tell. Actually, we are kind of having a hard time being able to tell, but it is brighter by a little bit. Seven to nine hours later, and in our case, I think it was eight hours we did it for? Yeah, eight hours. Um, we've got uh, some delicious looking pork. And we're going to have rice pilaf and, uh, and peas with that. No idea what it tastes like, but it was submitted by William and I'm excited to confirm the deliciousness. Oh, and just like I said, I spent most of the day playing da -da -da, Fallout 3. I paused somewhere near the end of the game. I don't want to spoil anything for anybody, but I will definitely say I was at the end of the game. Holy crap. Luckily, I did save my save file from like a year or so ago when I had played, and I was level 28. Now I'm level 30. I can't venture past any more levels. There's nothing left to do. But because I have the expansion, um, Brotherhood of Steel, or I don't know what I don't know what the expansion's called, but there's an expansion that lets you play past the end of the game. And I'm I'm now past the Fallout 3 ending and I'm into the next ending. So Mallory's never even seen this because she played it on the Xbox um, without any of the expansions. So I'm working my way through something that's new to both of us. You have the first bite of pork, what do you think? Pretty good. Pretty good? Is it different? Mm -hmm. I'm excited. Mmm. Ooh, that is good. You can really taste the Dijon mustard in that. I taste the brown sugar. Yeah, okay, the brown sugar. That is awesome. That's really good. If you're not a practicing Jew, vegetarian, vegan, or pescatarian, you might want to give that a shot. Because that is some good stuff. Well, Mallory and I finished up dinner, and then we had some uh, sparkling pear juice, which is strange. We had got it at Ikea. It was, it was really cheap, and uh, we had had it in our cupboard for a long time. We are like, hey, let's have some of that, and let's celebrate Sunday for being one of seven days of the week. It was really good, though. Um, I, I know I don't talk too much about it, but... Probably one of my favorite fruits in the world is pears. I would say it's tied for the top spot. What it's tied with, I don't know. Probably like strawberries and peaches, but uh, I'm a really, really big fan of pears. I can't say that we accomplished a whole lot today, but we did make really awesome food, and I beat Fallout 3. I mean, sort of. I, I beat the, the main game. I still get to do the, uh, the expansion, but the, from what I understand, there's probably not that much left in the game. Um, so I am excited to finally finish that up tomorrow. And before I sign off, I will say that uh, I've read through your comments, or at least the ones that were posted uh, up until 10 p.m. I think there was like 60 or 70 or so. So I read through them and um, a lot of differing opinions, but I think at least for now I'm going to stick with friends. A lot of people made a lot of good points. Some of the points being, does it really matter that I call you anything? Um, I don't call you guys stuff that often. It doesn't really affect anything. No one's going to leave because of it. It doesn't really matter a whole lot. And if it's something that bothers me so much, a lot of people agreed that I should change it. So from now on, at least for a while, I'm going to call you guys friends. So hi, friends. And goodbye, friends. So that's going to be it for today. But thank you guys so much for watching. And uh, let's meet back tomorrow, shall we?